Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. My name is David A. Kwan, and welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my Sunday vlog. The Sunday, finally, life's not so busy and I finally can make this video vlog. <laughs> um, I know it's been a while, but this is gonna be the update and uh, what's been going on with my life video, okay? I'm gonna talk to you guys about what movies I've seen recently, video games I've been playing, recently purchased. Towards the end of the video, instead of a QA, and a because here's what happened, all right? In the previous Sunday vlog that I made, I asked you guys to ask me questions for the Sunday vlog, uh, for, the, for the next Sunday vlog, for, for the Q&A segment, right? A lot of you guys who asked questions in the last Sunday vlog actually uh, uh, appeared in my live streams and asked me the same questions. I was able to answer your questions there. So instead, what I'm going to do is do a frequently asked questions. I'm going to do an FAQ fact segment, okay? A lot of you guys keep asking me, hey David, where have you been going recently? What movies have you seen? What movies have you been playing? Uh, uh, what were you on Halloween? What did you dress up as? What, what did you do on Halloween? I'm going to answer those questions today. All right. Uh, the first movie I saw in the past since the last Sunday vlog, I did see, well, not Halloween Kills. I saw Halloween Ends. Okay. The most recent of the Halloween movies. Uh, it's not out on DVD or anything like that. Uh, it's still in theaters at, 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 the, at the moment of this video. Uh, I saw it. If you guys want to see what I think about it, uh, there is a two part live stream of it that's right i actually live stream myself watching the movie so you can guys can watch the movie yourselves press play because it's available on the peacock app okay if you have the peacock app the movie's available for free on there all right so you can watch the you can stream the movie yourself and, and watch it on there i saw halloween ends I, I recorded my reaction to it and i thought the movie was good okay i didn't understand why they went the way they did okay but it was a very satisfying ending michael myers uh, and uh, Lori Strode finally got into this, the big final showdown, all right? And I thought it was good. I thought it was uh, probably like an 8 out of 10, all right? I, I, I thought it was a, a pretty decent movie. Um, uh, it actually finally ended. It was a satisfying ending, all right? Uh, there were some parts where I was like, why did they put that in the movie? What was the whole point of this? Um, There's a lot of filler-related stuff. But overall, when the, when the Michael Myers and Laurie Strode showdown happened, it was very satisfying. Let's just say that, all right? I did see, people have been asking me that, 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 that for a very long time and wanted me to make a separate video about it. Uh, technically, I can, um, but uh, I don't know. I think the, the, the hype has died down a little bit because I've been so busy, I, I couldn't make that video. I did see Black Adam in theaters. I went to see with my girlfriend the weekend it came out, okay? I did make a YouTube short uh, when we walked out of the theater, our initial thoughts coming out of the theater, okay? Uh, we both say it was an 8 out of 10 based on the action, but probably give it a lower grade, um, probably because of the complicated plot, okay? Now, I am familiar with Black Adam. I've seen the Superman Shazam uh, uh, Black, Black Adam movie, okay? So I, I've seen this fight before. Uh, well, they didn't have the Superman Shazam fight in it, but... Um, uh, I, I am familiar with these characters, you know, Hawkman and Dr. Fate. I've seen them before. They were on Smallville. I've seen them on the Justice League cartoon and stuff like that. But my, for my girlfriend, uh, uh, she was overwhelmed a little bit, okay? So for her, there was there was too many new characters. There was too much plot going on at the same time. It was very complicated to follow, okay? Um, and I kind of agree. Like, if I was an outsider, too, uh, looking in, in, in his characters for the first time, I'd be probably kind of lost myself, okay? There were twists and turns throughout the movie, but uh, I thought it was very enjoyable. Lots of action. Go check it out if you haven't seen it already. All right. Uh, I know the critic scores are really low, but the audience scores are actually pretty high. Uh, go see it for yourself. You want to know what it, what it, what it, what it was like. Okay. Uh, I enjoyed it. Okay. But of course, being me and what I'm into, I, you already know I'm going to enjoy it. I like the comic book movies. Okay. Black Panther is about to come out. I'm looking forward to seeing that one too. All right. My girlfriend and I did see Batman Soul of the Dragon. I wish she was here with me. She can talk about it too, okay? Uh, but uh, she's at work right now, and, and this, is, this, is, this is my time to actually finally uh, make this video. So I saw this movie. It's, it's like an Elseworld movie, okay? It's like, it doesn't follow the same uh, canon as, as many of the other DC animated sh uh, movies that have been coming, ra coming out. So Bruce Wayne teams up with Lady Shiva, and a couple other people from their from their past, okay? There was like uh, this dragon dude or whatever, okay? Took place in the 1970s. Basically, there was this gate and there was this 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 cult trying to open up the gate and release evil all over the world and stuff like that. And it's up to these four characters to, to stop the gate from, hap from op being open, okay? So, 
throughout the movie, they have tons of flashbacks, keep going flashing back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. That was the confusing part to me. I wish it was just like, like, let's see them as kids, okay, learning and stuff like that, and then see them finally defend the, the, the gate, you know? Uh, I'd rather see that. But I, I thought the, 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 the how the, the, the story is, it's it's okay, okay? I just wish they'd give me a little uh, little warning that it's going to flip back and forth between flashbacks and, 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 and the present day uh, before I even saw the movie, okay? But overall, it was a pretty good plot, okay? A different story. It's, that, it's, it's nothing related to the Batman. As, as a matter of fact, Batman is not even, even though his name is in the title, he wasn't exactly the main character, you know? There was a lot of focus on, on the other characters, like Lady Shiva and, and the other, and the other uh, characters that you see in the movie, all right? Um, overall, the animation quality is different uh, than, than what you're used to, okay? But uh, it's a pretty nice story, you know? But you don't have to watch it. You, don't, you really don't. Uh, it has nothing to do that. There's nothing to take away with you. Uh, very nice story. Uh, there's uh, some cute moments. My girlfriend was like, "Boy, men are, are really different," you know, because there's one plot, uh, one one part where uh, there was a flashback to um, to this dude. I, I forgot his name. And Bruce Wayne when they were still learning, and they're like beating each other up, and Bruce Wayne refused to to give up, and then. The, the, the dude would like respect him, you know, he's like, let, let me buy you some, some food or whatever, you know, <laughs> and, and my girlfriend was like, man, men are weird, like, if, 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 it was, if there was two women, we would fight to the death, <laughs> you know, <laughs> they would just like to like, show respect or anything like that, you know, it was, it would be, it was different, so I thought that that, that was, common, was, was funny co coming from her. Um, there was one part in the movie, there was like uh, a motorcycle chase sequence, right, and there was like one bad guy on the motorcycle, one of the cult dudes, and then Lady Shiva walked up and sliced off his head! Like, you actually see the head was like flying across the screen. And like, I'm like, what the crap? <laughs> oh yeah, I guess it, I guess that's okay. It's rated R. I didn't realize that, okay? I didn't see the R rated until like now, when I actually saw the box. But okay, it actually it makes sense now. People being beheaded, heads flying across the screen, blood all over the place. Okay, it makes sense now. It's, it's an R-rated movie. <laughs> I, was, I was like, what the heck? Some, some, some kids probably watch this, this stuff, you know? Uh, kids watch car cartoons too. Okay, now this next movie is definitely a, a, a movie for, for kids, okay? I watched with my cousins, uh, DC League of Super Pets. It's also got the Drain the Rock Johnson in it, okay? Um, as, uh, as Crypto the Super Dog. Uh, Ace Bat Hound is also also in it, played by Kevin Hart. The movie's cute. The movie's really it has a lot of heart in it. Okay, and that, plus that, I love the music and, and the settings and stuff like that. Like at the beginning of the movie, they actually used the Christopher Reeve Superman theme, and they actually had like like the same same outfits and the same planet, the the the, the, the shape of his, his ship and stuff like that. It's a really cute movie. All right, and they use like the Batman theme and stuff like that. Keanu Reeves plays Batman in this movie, and uh. It's quite fitting, actually. So the Justice League got captured, okay, by uh, by a bald, by a bald, bald pet, okay, Lulu, the guinea pig, and then she took over the place, man. She got orange kryptonite, and then other characters got orange kryptonite also. Orange kryptonite gives gives animals uh, powers, okay. So uh, Crypto, who temporarily lost his powers, had to have to recruit. Um, uh, the help of Ace the Bat Hound and PB the Wonder Pig and all these other characters to uh, to help save the Justice League. Okay, and basically later there was a huge boss battle. All, all the all the Justice League heroes got got their own pets and stuff like that. Really cute story. Okay, uh, there's there's one part where it's like uh, where um, Ace Ace and uh, and Crypto were like talking to each other and and they were like uh, Ace has a really uh, sad uh, backstory by the way. A really sad backstory. Uh, but they were like, what do dogs do? What do we do as dogs? We love un unconditionally. Like, I, I thought it was a really sweet moment, okay? You gotta see it for yourself, okay? So, DC League of Super Pets, I saw it with my cousins. It's a great movie, all right? So, some of the stuff we've seen. I'm gonna hold this up as the, uh, as the thumbnail right here, okay? So I saw Black Adam, I saw Super Pets. Okay, let's talk about video games. There's this one video game I'm playing on the Switch. It's awesome. It's called Cover Fire. It's a free game on the Switch. Download it. It's a third-person cover shooter, all right? Uh, think, uh, think Gears of War. Uh, each mission probably takes like, like, like 20 seconds to beat. But it's a fun, fun game. You still have to upgrade yourself and stuff like that to actually move on because the, eventually the, there, there's like boss fights and stuff like that too. Um, 
that will probably take like five minutes to beat the beat beat the beat the mission. Okay, but there's like tons of there's like sniper missions. There's like over the shoulder missions. There's like bomb missions. Where you're holding a bazooka and trying to shoot at everything. Um, there was like uh, like mech missions. Like you have to drive a, a robot and try to shoot everything. Like 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 Titanfall or something like it. Mech warrior type type of stuff. You know, uh, the fun, game's fun. It's free. It's free. That's the, that's the cool thing about it. Okay, so check out check out that game on Switch. I'm playing Animal Crossing New Horizon. You guys saw me uh, unbox it the last time I was uh, I made a Sunday vlog. I've been playing that game. That is a huge time waster, by the way. Like if you want to just just like like just play before bed or something like that. Like next thing you, I I was laying down. It was like ten o'clock at night. Next thing I know, I was playing and uh, I, I was playing uh, Animal Crossing New Horizon. I looked at the clock. It's like one o'clock. I was like, what the heck? Like, where did time go? <laughs> so, so check out Animal Crossing, okay? Um, I got the box, uh, got the box somewhere. Uh, don't worry about it. But anyway, uh, it's, it's, it's kind of a, uh, uh, a game where you're just doing menial, like, you're just not doing anything. You're just fishing, cutting down wood, harvesting apples and stuff like that. And the next thing you know, four hours have passed. It's, it's like, it's a crazy, uh, crazy game. It take, takes up all, all, all your time, okay? You're like mes mesmerized by it, okay? Helps time go by quick. Finally, uh, I did buy recently. Uh, I went to GameStop the other day, okay? And I was like, what am I going to get? New Modern Warfare 2? Uh, what, what, should I get the Sniper Elite 5? Okay? I ended up getting WWE 2K22, all right? And I got to say, this game is freaking fun. And I haven't really played the game. Uh, I just like the um, going to the community creations and then downloading. The other day, I did live stream with my cousin. We were downloading like like eight different Spider-Man characters, having them battle it out uh, in, in the ring, you know, go for the championship. It was crazy. The other day, I had like six Batmans. I had like the, the Robert Pattinson Batman, the Ben Affleck Batman, Michael Keaton Batman, George Clooney Batman, Christian Bale Batman, and they were all like fighting each other. I was like, this is crazy. Like, I, I, I love the, the fact that you can actually put all these community creations in the game and stuff like that. There's like a story mode. There's a Rey Mysterio showcase mode and stuff like that. I haven't touched that at all. I've been having so much fun just watching the matches. I'm not even playing the game. I'm just watching the, the simulations. And it, it's like freaking fun, man. So I, 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 I'm glad I picked up this game, okay? Uh, I don't know if, if picking up My Warfare 2 would have been the better decision. But so far, I do not regret at all. Pick up WD 2K22. I'm gonna play this game some more later on. Okay. Um, okay. Let's get to the uh, the Q and A segment, the, the the FAQ segment. Actually, uh, what I do recently, I went to the TFTI Interactive Selfie Museum. So, go to uh, the video about Gemma's birthday. Gemma's my, my my niece. Okay, it was her birthday recently, and we went to this interactive selfie museum. In there, take your phones. Okay. And there's like backdrops everywhere. You can take different pictures from different angles and stuff like that. And uh, there's like things, there's like machines where you can blow feathers out. And then uh, there were machines. Uh, you can, there's, there's a room with everything's upside down and stuff like that. Uh, there's like huge mushrooms and, 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 and pretty uh, backgrounds of, of cherry blossoms. There's pretty, pretty, uh, there's all sorts of different backgrounds. Okay, you can spend like, a, like an hour or two in there. Um, so... Being as a, it was a birthday celebration, I actually experienced it for free. There's some pretty, uh, there's like an all mirror room. There's a room with a bunch of, a uh, bunch of toys in it. There's a room with a bunch of balloons and whatever. It's a pretty cool place to go, all right? Uh, here it's like $20, 30 if you want to go. Uh, uh, but, uh, but I think you, it, it's uh, interesting. Uh, you, you'll, get, you'll get some pretty pictures, like, right? Okay, Halloween. What did I do on Halloween, all right? Um... On actual Halloween, I just went to work, okay? And my girlfriend and I uh, went to some uh, some uh, furniture stores looking for some furniture for our new house and stuff like that, okay? Uh, if you haven't, uh, no, we recently moved, moved in together, okay? Uh, but I still have to go back to this house because my job is closer to here. So uh, I would, like, uh, uh, spend the whole week pretty much here. And then uh, on towards the weekends, like Friday uh, after work, I would drive to the new house and spend some time with her and stuff like that, you know? Uh, but Halloween, on actual Halloween, that's all we did. I went to work uh, that night, okay? Uh, they did make us, uh, not make us, but they, they did uh, give us the option of wearing our costumes to work, okay? I went as Charlie Brown. I had the, the shirt with the yellow. You've seen it before. Uh, I wore it to uh, like a Comic-Con way back when, uh, when I was uh, living in Kansas, okay? The day before Halloween, the 30th, okay? That was the, the, the big day. That, that was uh, the, 
the the celebrating part of our our uh, the, the the highlight of our, our our Halloween weekend. All right. Uh, so my girlfriend's job had a Halloween party. Uh, good food. They had like fried chicken. They had like variety of desserts. They had noodles. They had soup. They had all sorts of uh, alcoholic drinks and beverages there. Also, okay, it was a fun, fun, uh, fun time. Um, they played a lot of games and stuff like that. There was a game where there was a bowl of seeds, and we had to like put a, a spoon in our mouth and try to scoop the seeds and bring it back to the the, the, the our, our beginning station. You know, uh, see who would get the seeds out uh, first and stuff like that. There was another game. Uh, that I was involved in. They put like two apples right here, and everyone has to like chop off the apples. Whoever eats all the apples first, the, uh, you know, our, our, our teammates would line up and try to take a bite out of the apple and then uh, run back. There were other games uh, where it's like uh, kind of like a like a, a green light, a red light sort of thing. Uh, if you're wearing red, go to the next next uh, like a musical chair sort of thing. You know, go go, go to the next opening. Uh, uh, across the, the, the room or stuff like that, whatever, okay? There were a lot of different games, a lot of good food, um, new friends and stuff like that. Uh, people were commenting on our costumes and stuff like that. There was a costume contest. We were uh, marching down um, the aisles, uh, wearing our costumes. So if you guys want to know what, what I was, okay, on Halloween, I was Ke Ash Ketchum. My girlfriend was 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 uh, was uh, Pikachu, okay? And when we went up to present our costumes, I did the cutest thing. You guys can watch the video if you guys want. Uh, it's, it's, it's on my YouTube channel. Halloween 2022. Uh, the pedicure place. Okay. Um, so we. we uh, Ash Ketchum and, and, and Pikachu. I walked over and I was like. Pikachu. I choose you. I was like. Pointing at my girlfriend. Everyone was going. Oh, they were so sweet. That was so cute. And stuff like that. We were marching down. Um, it, it was a good time. Okay. A lot of good food. Uh, a lot of uh, a lot of new friends. Okay, good, great drinks, uh, fun games. That was my the highlight of, of the uh, of the weekend. Besides that, just going to work wearing my Charlie Brown costume. I had I had a little Snoopy Snoopy uh, plush with me too. I was carrying that around. Uh, uh, also, all right, guys. So that's it when it comes to my Sunday vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Okay, uh, more live streams coming in the future of mainly WWE. I I I, I, I assuming. Okay. Uh, what are games I've uh, recently downloaded? I think that's it. Like, I, I just want to play WWE right now. <laughs> this is, you know, this game came out months ago. I'm just, I'm, I'm just now playing it, okay? Having a good time with it. Uh, yeah, check out some of the uh, movies recently. Uh, hopefully, uh, you see my reaction to Black Panther pretty soon. Oh, yeah, I have a Ninja Turtles video. I have a Halo Infinite Collection video coming out. Uh, there's some good stuff coming up uh, in, in, the, in the future, all right? Thank you for watching, everyone. Be sure to rate, comment, favorite, and subscribe. Spread the word about the, about the channel. I'll, t I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.